We still have a choice today, nonviolent coexistence, a violent co-annihilation. In the name of peace, democracy and freedom for all. By any means necessary. The Daughters of Sharecroppers, Althea Gibson, became a tennis sensation in the 1950s. Her 1956 triumph at the French Tennis Championships, later known as the French Open, made her the first black woman ever to win a major singles title. The next year, she won singles titles at both Wimbledon and the U.S. Championships and repeated the feat in 1958. Althea was often referred to as the Jackie Robinson of tennis. She became the first African-American to break the color barrier on the World Tennis Tour. She retired as an amateur after the 1958 season, having become an acclaimed public figure. Before the open era began, there was no prize money other than an expense allowance and no endorsement deals. To begin earning prize money, tennis players had to give up their amateur status. As there was no professional tour for women, Gibson was limited to playing in a series of exhibition tours. In 1971, she was inducted into the International Tennis Hall of Fame. And in later years, she suffered two cerebral aneurysms in 1992, a stroke. A few years later, Gibson called her former doubles partner, Angela Buxton, and told her she was living on welfare, unable to pay for rent or medication, and considering suicide. Buxton arranged for a letter to appear in a tennis magazine, unbeknownst to Gibson. As a result, Gibson received nearly $1 million from fans all around the world. She finally passed away in 2003 at the age of 76, and on opening night of the 2007 U.S. Open, Gibson was inducted into the U.S. Open Court of Champions. After I finished my match, I went home, relaxed, had my supper, and uh, discussed with my coach what had to be done the next day, and that was it. I considered it a great education to be able to travel around the world as I did being the first black uh, female tennis champion of the world to have this privilege. And I enjoyed it tremendously. I learned a lot, uh, I saw a lot, and I played a heck of a lot of tennis all over the world.